This is the one I was waiting for. Oh, God. Which character said, that's right, my dumb <laughs> hungry <laughs> Yeah, that's my stupid <laughs> gonna f you so hard you get a brain injury. Stay permanently like this. Just a f pretty face. And to whom? <laughs> oh my <Was> god! It? <laughs> folks welcome back to who wants to be a fan fictionaire the show where we ask a random person scandalous questions about your favorite fan fiction and fan fiction couples and kinks today we have a very special guest come on down gage <laughs> all right chill fucking chill okay. Sit down. jesus <laughs> christ it's a game show i wanted to make it like game show all right guys here's that's probably way too close. <laughs> All right, guys, here's the rub. <laughs> here's the rub, friends. Today we're playing things a little differently. We're gonna be doing a game show type situation, where as opposed to who wants to be a millionaire because we're poor, it's gonna be who wants to be a fan fictionaire. It's poor people of fan fiction. Yeah. I have a series of questions to ask you. I, here's the thing, I've read fan fiction. I have my own dumb dumb. I know you wanna suck on this. Oh. Oh. <laughs> but I don't like, I'm not big on fan fiction. Right. Assume you're every I have moment. Dibbled. I have dabbled. Have you doubled? I've, I, don't know. I, don't, I don't know if I'd say I've doubled. You're not a doobler. <laughs> I'm, I'm not a fan thing doobler. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll see how much you know about I'm really nervous. anything I'm at all. Really I'm not going to get a million dollars from this. No. You, you will get to not be punished. Right in a series of humiliating punishments <laughs> that you created <laughs> for yourself. And I'd like them to go up on the screen right now. Can I be honest? What's up? I'm super nervous. You should be. Sh I'm really, You're not gonna get I'm any really of these fucking nervous. answers, dude. Look at my little cue cards. <laughs> You're such a good little host with your bow tie. I am. <laughs> <laughs> Sniff this. <laughs> Paint shouldn't smell bad. Oh, oh my god, I'm oh. so sorry. Is it black on my nose? <laughs> Let me explain this, break this down for you guys. I have a series of questions here in my hands relating to fan fiction, things about fan fiction. If you're familiar with fan fiction, you might know the answers. And that's great, but Gage probably does not know the answers because he doesn't read porn, he watches it. Like a regular, I'm not going to say that. People that read fanfic, have fun, I don't care. We have higher IQs than you guys do. Um, so basically what we have here is a series of 20 questions, each worth five points. Gage needs to get a certain amount of points to get out of different tiers of punishments. Yeah. So he needs essentially four questions correct to move from tier to tier. That's not gonna happen. Um, <laughs> but we'll find out. Who knows? Who knows? I just want to get out of the trash. So Who knows? Do. Are you ready, sir? <sighs> I'm ready to be a fan fictionaire. I need you to know. Yeah. You have two lifelines. Two lifelines. You have two lifelines. I'm gonna call my mom. <laughs> and you have one of the like. Like the take splits? two. Yeah, take, take two, two, off? Okay. two off. If you're doing really bad, I'll give you two. <laughs> I'm not a demon. Oh my god. Are you ready? I. Let's go. <laughs> All right, folks. It's time for who wants to be a fan fictionaire. Let's fucking go. Okay. <laughs> the following summary is from a fan fiction. Okay. From which fandom? Okay. Every merfolk has a secret. They can shed their tail and walk on Earth. <laughs> oh, no. Is it A, Formula One RPF? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? B, NFL RPF. C, Golf <laughs> RPF. Dude, or D, NASCAR RPF. Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> Let me know if you need me to repeat the question. No, I'm, I'm fine. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so tired between... The only reason... I want to say NFL because the Dolphins are a, <laughs> are a team. Who has the hottest people, though? That's the question. Probably Formula One. Is that your final answer? Oh, it's... I'm going to stick to my guns. I'm going to say the NFL. The yeah, answer is Formula One. Oh, you no. are so close. They have the hottest people. They have the hottest people. 
<laughs> Those damn race car drivers. They're so <laughs> sexy. Oh my god. Here's, here's I gotta get in the mind of I gotta get in the mind of fanfic readers and writers. That's mm -hmm. what I gotta do. You gotta get get out of your mindset. Get into theirs. Mindset, you're right. You gotta think like they think. I think, that they think this right thing is that. spinning in my hand, dude. <laughs> <laughs> the stick is so thin. Look at this. Next question. Gage. Ooh, that stinks. <laughs> <laughs> Which character okay. said, "Quote: I read about it. I want to feel opened like that." And I want you oh to open me. <laughs> and to whom? Was it A, Hermione to Draco, okay. B, Jesse Pinkman, no, oh, that was loud, Jesse Pinkman to Mike, <laughs> C, Mike Wazowski to Sully, <laughs> or D, Naruto to Sasuke? Gotta, I gotta go with the fanfic writers, A, Hermione to Ron. I said Draco, but okay. Oh, to Draco. It's Jesse. What Mike. the fuck? <laughs> Why? Why not? Why, are Jesse Why can't an old like man fucking? fuck? Jesse said that to Mike? Yes. He wrote about it. Jesse reads. You think Jesse doesn't read? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I guess Jesse reads. And I'm going to get a fucking zero on this. Whole <laughs> Slow start, but he'll get there. I, he'll get one of these. I know it. I can feel it. <laughs> I have one question here that I'm not going to tell you which one it is, but if you get it right, it will automatically bump you up a tier. Oh, fuck yeah. It's a pretty widely known thing, so I'm hoping that you're going to the answer to it. All right, here's the next question. The following summary is from a fanfic. Okay. Which fandom do you believe this summary is in regards to? A, Hamilton. B, Five Nights at Freddy's. Okay. C, Teen Titan. Or D, One Direction. Did I even read the summary? Read the summary. <laughs> <laughs> Figure I was it so out. ready. I was like, here's the summary. Character A receives an accidental dick pic from character B. Okay. Now is character A's time to strike. So is that. That's it? Is that. Oh my <laughs> fucking god. <laughs> is, that, is it A, Hamilton? It can't be Hamilton. There's no dick pics in Hamilton. It, do you know what an AU is? Alternate reality. You gotta yeah. think. You gotta think big, bro. You gotta oh think big. You gotta think big. I'm between Hamilton and Five Nights. Hamilton. It is yeah! Hamilton! <laughs> I don't know the character's name. Woo! And I don't care. Who was? Who was the character? You don't have Hamilton down? and somebody named John. Maybe is oh that a guy? God. Is that a guy? I mean, there's like John Hancock. <laughs> yeah, not really that guy. His name's just fucking like John Adams. I don't know. So Gage now has five points on the board. <laughs> I'm. This is. This is. I'm so. I dude. I'm wet right now, <laughs> <Ew>. bro. <laughs> She's hard, dog. Right. I'm stressing. You know what else we need to do? We need to introduce you to the people because they don't know who you are. Yeah, let's do so that. So I think you should take a seat. And tell us a little bit about Gage O'Grady. Let's check that out. Hey, my name is uh, Gage. I'm from San Antonio, Texas. Just a just a normal guy. I love going outside, getting the outdoors, you know, and just kind of, you know, seeing where seeing where life takes me out there in the in the wilderness. Uh, I love hanging out with my friends. We play catch sometimes, and they're just they're they're a good group, you know. We just have a good time. Just. <laughs> back and forth. Right now I'm, I'm basically just a crypto millionaire. That's where I've made the, the dollar bills lately and it's been it's been good. It's been really good to me and my family. Uh, it's really helped us stay afloat these, these past few years. It's been rough out there for everyone, but we've been fine. Um, I've watched a lot of things. I've seen a lot of things. I've seen a lot of porn and I've read a fair amount of, of fanfic and porn. So I think I think I've got a leg up in this competition. But most importantly, I'm just I'm just here. I'm happy for the experience. You know, I'm happy that that the show reached out to me and, and, and invited me to be a part of this this journey. And 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 they've just been great. They've been so good to me so far, and I'm I'm really excited. Good dick. What the fuck are you doing in here? <laughs> all right. Well, that is Gage O'Grady. I guess that's all we really need to know about that's, you as a person. That's all you need to know. As a human being. As a game show. As a person on a game show, I have no personality. <laughs> here's here's your next question. Ready? Okay. Define the following kink. Okay. Somnophilia. Oh. Here's our here's your possible answers. A. Sex in a plane cockpit. B. <laughs> B. Eating beans during anal. <laughs> C. Clown sex. Or D. Sex with a sleepy motherfucker. 
Somnophilia. Uh, I think I'd like to use a, a lifeline. <laughs> oh, okay, 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 okay. Yeah, 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 I'd like to use a lifeline. Go for May it. May I? Yeah, who can go? Okay, I'm gonna call my mom. Oh, your mommy? Yeah, I'm okay. gonna call my mom. Do you think your mom knows what somnophilia is? Dude, if your mom fucking knows, your aunt probably does. That's the thing. I'm gonna call her on speaker. All right, so Gage is using one of his lifelines right I'm gonna use right a lifeline. Now. I'm gonna call my mom. Okay, go for it. Wait, okay. tell her what we're doing, though. I, I, I'll, I'm gonna give her the rundown. Don't you worry. I'm gonna pretend I'm, I'm on a real game show. That's so, it's me reading the question, Gage. <laughs> so good. No. Hello. Hey, hey, mom. Are you busy? No. Okay, real quick. I need help with something. I'm on a game show. Okay. And you're my lifeline. Uh-huh. Okay, so I'm going to have the host read the question to you real quick. If you know it, help me out. If not, it, it's okay, okay? Are you ready for the host okay. to read? I'm ready. <laughs> okay, define the following kink. The kink is called somnophilia. Is it A, sex in a plain cockpit? B, eating beans during anal? C, clown sex? Or D, sex with a sleepy motherfucker. <laughs> with a what? Sleepy a, sl motherfucker. a sleepy motherfucker. Come on, Mom, I know you got this. Somnophilia? Somnophilia. Somnophilia. Somnophilia is a you sleepy... It'll be a sleepy motherfucker. Yeah? You know etymology. Well, uh, som deals with sleeping. Okay. Or, or tiredness. Or yeah. Fatigue. Okay, okay. So that's what I would say. I'm gonna I'm gonna trust the lifeline. Uh, my final answer, Somnophilia is that sleepy is motherfucker. Correct. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mom. You're <laughs> okay, I gotta go. All right, bye. Goodbye. That worked Ooh, out so yes, well. Let's go, lifeline! That was really good. Your that mom's was, smart, bro. No, let's go. She knows she knows things. Damn, your mom knows stuff and things? That's crazy. Okay. I can't believe she's one on board with that, too. She's like, okay, whatever. <laughs> what is the most popular pairing okay. in South Park fan fiction? A, Craig and Tweak. Oh, it's got to be Craig B, and Tweak. Stan and Kyle. Oh, that's a good one, too. C, Kenny and Butters. Mm. Or D, Wendy and Stan. It's not a straight couple. There's no way. Just it's got to be. It's got to be a gay it. couple. Okay. I know fanfic writers. They're all gay. I. I mean, Tweak and Craig is the. That's the go-to man. I'm. Can I? Can I fifty-fifty this? Sure. No. No. Tweak and Craig. Lock Tweak it in. Craig? Tweak and Craig. Lock it in. It is yeah! Tweak and Craig. Woo! It is canon. We did a whole episode about it. <laughs> Dude, you're killing it. That's three right That's now. Three in a row. That's really good. You I need, need one, one more, more and I get out of those choices. But then you're sitting in. I'm sitting in trash. trash at that point. Okay. So. All right. Next question. You're I'm, on. A I'm roll. feeling good. You're on I'm a feeling roll. really good about myself right now. I, what I, do you think in your personal life has led you to getting this many right in a row? Um, my mom knowing what somnophilia is for I'm sure. Stop up. You need to come forward. And, oh. Yeah. <laughs> It's it's my it's my mom knowing somnophilia mostly. It does stink. <laughs> <laughs> All right, who is oh my God. <laughs> who is Eraserhead for my hero? Sure. You know who Eraserhead yeah. is. Yeah. Daddy, if I will. Yeah. Most frequently shipped with. Oh, okay. A. All Might. B. Present Mike. C. Midnight. Or D. Principal. That's also a weasel. I mean, Most frequently. Right, sure. right. I, I, it's got to be gay again, so I'm immediately taking Midnight out of it. You're really starting to get I, I understand. And so the professor angle is, is like All Might and Eraser. That's a good professor angle. I'm going to go with All Might. All Might's your final all answer? All Might's final answer. It is Present Mike. Present oh, Mike? Man. Why? He wants him to scream right into his asshole, and I'll tell Who you what. Who cares about Present Mike? They grew up together. They were friends in high school. Oh my they god. They had a dream to become pro heroes and they're friends. This is ri this is ridiculous. You might have to do a 50-50 split on this one. Okay. <laughs> so your chance question. Next question, are you ready? Yeah. How do you feel? I that one hurt the ego a little bit. I was feeling real good on that run and now I'm now I'm kind of feeling like I'm taking a step back. But I'm ready to get back on the on track. Alright. Which character said, Wow, how did you know I love Wendy's? <laughs> and to whom? Oh my god. A Shrek to Guy Fieri. What? <laughs> B, Obama to Guy Fieri. Why? Oh, Guy Fieri's in a lot of fanfics. I've read Guy C, Fieri fanfics. Son of a bitch. Mothman to Guy Fieri. Oh my god, it's or all to Guy Fieri? D, 
Gordon Ramsay to Guy Fieri. While that Gage is thinking about this one, let's uh, check out this clip of us interviewing him or something. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure out what it is. All right, Gage, welcome to Who Wants to Be a Fan Fiction Air. Hey, hey. How are you feeling today? I feel good. I feel confident. You feel confident? I feel confident. I actually, I'm nervous. You're nervous? I mean, that's natural. I'm you know. but I'm confident. Do you think you have what it takes to answer the age-old question, who wants to be a fan fictionaire? I don't think anyone else on this earth is as ready as I am. Here's the thing. I have nothing to back up my confidence. Oh, okay. We love to hear it. We love to see yeah. it. Yeah. Because um, it could go either way. Yeah. You know what I mean? The, the truth is, I just don't want to get trash on me. I'm aiming for a 40. That's <laughs> well, we're happy to have you, and we can't wait to see uh, your knowledge in action. Thanks. I can't wait to be on the show. All right. Well, get out there and win that money. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm, I'm going to have to use my split. Okay, you're going to use one of your I'm splits? Gonna use, I'm going to use my split. Okay, it is not Mothman to Guy Fieri. I wouldn't have said Mothman. I that couldn't sucks. find any Mothman Guy Fieri fanfic. Write it. And it wasn't Gordon Ramsay. Oh, Because Gordon yes. Ramsay would never even yes. win these. Yes. Or maybe he would. I don't know. Gordon Ramsay, would you? Gordon Ramsay's going to see this for sure. He's going to see this and he's going to love every second of it. In that case. So it's either Shrek to Guy Fieri or Obama to Guy Fieri. I was between Shrek and, and Gordon Ramsay. So with that, I think I've got to narrow down this. It's got to be Shrek. It's got to be Shrek? It's got to be Shrek. All right. Yeah? It is Obama. What? Why are they hanging out? That's such a dumb pairing. I hate it. No, Why are Obama out? and Guy Fieri hanging out and fucking on Wendy's? I just want to, side note. Oh my God. I had to read so many fan fictions to get these fucking <laughs> questions, you guys. And mind you, I already read so many fan fictions, but I read ones that... It, the good shit in it. The Guy Fieri and Obama, what are they talking what are they talking about? <laughs> they probably actually probably met. maybe I will. Which movie series was adapted from a fan fiction? Oh I know this. Twilight? Fifty Shades of Grey, I know this one. Fifty Shades of Grey it from is Twilight. Fifty Shades of yeah, Grey Yeah, I know this one. <laughs> Woo yes. Do you know what that means? That was the special question. Really? Yes. You bump up two tiers. Cause that was in two Yes! So I'm in tier three? You're in the waxing tier. Okay. No trash! No trash! That was the bro. secret question to see if Gage knew. Oh my god, I'm so relieved about that. Right. I also I wrote in the in the tears on this one. I I think that I've earned a like on the video. If you're oh, watching this, absolutely. please give it a like. Absolutely. For the love of God. For the love of God. <laughs> for the love of, of me having to do whatever it is at the end of this. Please <laughs> like it. Alright, next question. <laughs> Which character said Huh? I'm pregnant and I wanna keep it. I won't force you to raise it with me, but I'm keeping it. And that's my final decision. And to whom? SpongeBob to Plankton? Harry Potter to Voldemort? Okay. Nancy Wheeler to Vecna? Or Sonic to Shadow? I'm mostly leaning towards Sonic and Shadow. Okay. But I'm also pretty on, on with, uh, yeah. SpongeBob to Plankton, no. Nancy Wheeler to Vecna. Nancy Sonic Wheeler to, to Vecna Shadow. is the one that I'm... But it just, it just feels... Like a Sonic thing to say. Yeah, it's a Sonic. Son he's too good. Yeah, it's got to be good. Sonic and Shadow, right? It's SpongeBob. Oh, him. what? Ask yourself. Really think about it. How does that happen? Who got who pregnant? Plankton got SpongeBob pregnant. There's I not, had to read this. There's not enough comments. He inside. crawled inside and came in his whatever SpongeBob has that procreates, makes babies. A uterus, I guess. I don't know. SpongeBob. Sponges? Can they? Pro can they make? How do you make a sponge? Are you even saying that a sponge oh procreation? I think they just. I don't know, they're real. They're asexual. They're in, in, in objects. That's they're, just, they're just little things that grow in the sea floor, like rocks. I don't know. All I don't right. know that much about sponges. God. Porous is he. That's all I know. Porous <laughs> is he. <laughs> if, if you're playing along at home, I'd like to know how everyone else is doing. This stinks, dude. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Next question. <clears throat> Whom is Harry Potter most frequ frequently shipped with? Okay. Take her money out. <laughs> take her money out. Is it A... Draco. Oh. B. Hermione. No, take her. C. Snape. <clears throat> adult. Ooh. Fuck. Or D. Jenny. Jenny out. Hermione out. Played boring straight. Get him out of there. Get him out. Draco, interesting, but a Snape teacher, fucking, a professor. If Snape's fucking Harry. He's low key imagining James Potter, and he's like, "You fucking deserve this for stealing Lily from me." I think. I'm so wanting to say Draco. Um, my gut, 
my gut tells me that the writers of Harry Potter fan fiction, they know they know what their audience wants. They know what makes for good writing, and it's a great dynamic. It's a it's an opposite. It's opposites. It's Draco. It is Draco! I thought you were going to go with the Snape thing. Good job, no, man. Oh, it's Draco. So we're doing pretty good, dude. You're doing way better than I thought you'd do, pretty good. honestly. Pretty good. The following summary regarding which <clears throat> fandom. Character A, after a long day, takes his frustration out in the form of a sex worker he finds in the streets. He soon finds himself working to rescue character B, the sex worker, from the abusive bonds of their employer. <clears throat> A. Twilight. Am I doing too much? B. Sonic. C. Spongebob. Or D. Stranger Things. Uh. <laughs> D, 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 D Stranger Things? It's Sonic. Another Sonic? It's Sonic. Oh, the last one wasn't Sonic. Guess who's was the SpongeBob. prostitute? Sonic. Tail How did I lose sight of How Sonic? How did I fall so far? I'm just, okay. I had it together. I was so together. All right. So let's. Get away from our sponsors right now. Wendy's. I'm just kidding. <laughs> hey, uh, maybe, are you, do you have a product or an idea? Do you, do you maybe want your, did you like what you just saw? And maybe you want your things to show up right here after what you just saw. And then you sponsor us. And then after all the things that you just saw, it goes right here. And then, and then you give us money and we sell your products. Thanks, bye, everybody. Following summary is from a fan fiction from which fandom? Character A is a foul mouthed prostitute. I know this is going to sound really similar to the last question I just asked. <laughs> Character A is a foul mouthed prostitute just trying to make a living. Character B is a hard nosed cop who has taken an interest in him. Okay. What could possibly go wrong? Hard ass. Trying to think, which one? Ass. Which one of those franchises has like a really like sexy hard ass? I mean, the MCU is definitely. You can use a split on this one if you want. I would think I definitely want to use my split okay. on this one. I really think that I need to narrow this one down. I mean, Star Wars has obviously got Darth <clears throat> Vader. He's a hard ass. I mean, all the baddies in Star Wars are hard asses. They're just they have daddy issues. All of them have daddy issues. Um, but you know, in the MCU, you've got Nick Fury. Um, I think that. I think that Tony Stark would kind of be a hard ass. A prostitute just trying to make their way. I just think there's more appeal in the MCU. I, I'm going to go MCU. It is the MCU. You're right. It is. The prostitute is Bucky Barnes. Bucky Barnes, yeah. And the cop is Captain America. Oh. Yeah, yeah. yeah he would be a hard ass. He'd be a hard yeah. ass. Who would copy boy. get all up in a prostitute's business? Yeah. Mind your business, Captain America. Yeah, just trying to fuck, make ends Captain meet, America? Dad. God. The following summary is from a fan fiction from which fandom? The idea dominated his dreams, replacing his usual nightmare about the car crash that killed his parents. When he closed his eyes, <laughs> he saw his own cock magically elongate. Is it? <laughs> Harry Potter, <laughs> Batman, Iron Man, or Fifty Shades of Grey. Can Which get, fandom? Can I get one more read of the... Oh, you want me to read it again? Yeah, one more. <laughs> Magic, Dead Parents, Harry Potter. It's Harry Potter, bro! Yo! Yo! A popular abbreviation in fan fiction tags mm -hmm. is PWP. What does this stand for? Okay. Is it is it A, problems with penis? B, people want punishment? C, porn with plot? Or D, pussy weakness, please. How much fun did you have coming up? So much fun. <laughs> <laughs> dude, you can't have a stick in your I hand. I can, dude. dude. I have a minute. You have too much power. I think you're getting splinters from this fucking stick, dude. <laughs> you just put it. You just feel so strong. I'm not a Voldemort felt. If you have long, if you had long arms, dude, you'd be a, you'd be a oh, fucking be menace, dude. Yeah. What do you think? Uh, I'm I'm between porn with plot. I don't think it's pussy weakness. I don't think it would be a tag. <laughs> okay, you'd be and surprised. I don't think that penis problems would be a tag. <laughs> <laughs> but like, poor with plot and... People want punishment. People want punishment. Well, they're all plot-oriented. Okay. 
People want punishment. People want punishment is your yeah. final answer? It's porn. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch! It's the porn people want, but they also want a little bit of plot on top. Not a lot. Just a little bit. Next question. Yeah. Another popular theme or dynamic in fan fiction is abbreviated as ABO. Okay. What does this stand for? A. Yeah. Adventures, but overseas. <laughs> B. All boys orgasm. <laughs> C. Alpha, beta, omega. Okay. Or D. Awful bussy odor. That's a tag? One of those is a tag? One of Let me know if you need to read it again. I got a lifeline this one. Lifeline? I'm a lifeline this call. one. Oh, Hannah. <laughs> If she knows this, she nasty. Just kidding. <laughs> Just kidding. I read it too. <laughs> Cheyenne. You're going to call Cheyenne? Hello? Cheyenne? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, are you busy right now? Mm -hmm. Not necessarily. Why? Okay, I'm on a game show and you're my lifeline and I need help. Okay. Okay, are you, are you ready for the host to read the question? <laughs> okay, go for it. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Hi, Cheyenne. I love you. Hi, Brittany, I love you. <laughs> okay, here's the question. <laughs> okay. A popular theme or dynamic in fan fiction is abbreviated as A-B-O. What does this stand for? Is it A, adventures but overseas? Is it B, all boys orgasm? Is it C, alpha, beta, omega? Or is it D, awful bussy odor? <laughs> As much as I want to say D, I'm going to go with C. Alpha, beta, omega? Yes. I think that makes the most sense. I want it to be all boys orgasm. <laughs> of course you do. I, that one is pretty, pretty great, too. I, I, is that your final answer? I trust Cheyenne. That's correct! Yes! Thank you, Cheyenne! <laughs> yes! 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 Okay. Million. That's what I'm trying to do right now. Thank you so much. I got to go, but you're the best. <laughs> Goodbye. I can't believe <sighs> both two of your two, lifelines man. worked. Dude, who do I know? That's insane, dog. Hey, you gotta be connected in this world. You're welcome for Cheyenne, first of all. It's my wife. You gotta be connected in this <laughs> world, okay? That's all I'm saying. Do you, are you familiar, uh, familiar with Alpha, Beta, Omega? They think it's fun. It's crazy. It's really interesting. <laughs> <laughs> I needed you to know the definition of that because I have another question that kind of ties into this thing. Okay, cool. Cheyenne, I know Cheyenne's watching this. Cheyenne, you're a beautiful, lovely, beautiful human being. Yep. With a beautiful brain. Yep. And I love you. Thank you, Cheyenne. All right. Now that you know what ABO stands for, uh -huh. define this kink. Nodding. Is it A, penis swelling? B, self-lubricating anus? Okay. C, punching while coming? Or D, forgetting who you... You're having sex with during sex. I'm going to go with, I mean, penis swelling makes the most sense. That's the only one that is like a penis, penis swelling. It hey, is penis, penis, penis swelling, dude. Oh my God. I'm a genius. You're... Wow. Okay. Define the following kink. Okay. With the naughty. Is oh, it. Oh man. A. Pooping in a hat. B. Sex on a futon. C. Girl penis. Or D. Mermaid sex. Um, <laughs> every time you put the mic, I feel like I have to talk so quiet. It's like, <laughs> um, hi, yeah. So that sounds Japanese. No offense to the Japanese, but this makes me want to say that it's girl penis. It is girl Whoa! penis! I'm a genius! Good job, bud! Girl penis, girl penis! All right, the next? Woo! Okay. What's the most popular pairing in Stranger Things fan fiction? Okay. Is it A, Nancy and Steve? No. B, Eleven and Mike? No. C, Billy and Steve? Yes. D, Robin and Steve? Billy Steve. Yeah. Billy Steve. <laughs> Billy Steve, bro. Come on. That's so hot. Why would it <laughs> like, so, that's the hottest group. If I get one more right, you have to do a punishment. We have two more questions. Okay. This is the one I was waiting for. Oh, God. Which character said, 
That's right, my dumb cock hungry whore. Yeah, that's my stupid cock sleeve. Gonna fuck you so hard you get a brain injury. Stay permanently like this. Just a fuck hole with a pretty face. And to whom? Oh my Was god! It? <laughs> that's the one that I want you to be like, boop, boop, boop. Oh no! <laughs> Jesus! Was it A, Deku to Bakugo? Oh B, man. Bakugo to Deku. C, Bakugo to female Deku, or D, Deku to female Bakugo. Those are things. I think it's gonna be one of the one of the um, gender swaps. Okay. De- Male. Deku to fem Bakugo. Yeah. yeah! <laughs> oh. Wait, do you want to do the last question? Yeah. Okay. Fuck it. So I got. I don't have to do a punishment. What am I gonna have to do? Whatever you want to do. Whichever one you want. I'll do waxing. I'll do it with you. Not that much of a punishment. I kind of need to do it. <laughs> okay, let's see if you can get this last one, though. <sighs> oh, my God. Which? This one's... There's no do I get, like, a little bonus treat? Oh, I also get a share. That was the thing I asked for for the so final... So you guys have to like, subscribe, and, and share, share if you made it this far. Video. Thank you so much. If you don't Gage? Want to... Honestly? Okay, I made these questions not with the intention of Gage to fail, but I just wanted the funniest I think things. that I did really good. And you fucking crushed it and your lifelines came in clutch, dude. dude. So clutch. What the fu- without Boba's lifelines you would be I'd getting, getting raccoon eyes right now. Yeah. <sighs> okay. That's really crazy. Okay, last question. Which okay, the following summary is from a fanfic about from which fandom? Yeah. Due to due to a simple errand, character A falls victim to a lightning strike that somehow turns him into a girl. Is it The Walking Dead? One Punch Man? Arcane or South Park. Oh fuck! I don't know. I feel like it'd be like Walking Dead. It's South Park. Ah! But it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because I win, bro. I'm a fan fictioner. <laughs> Gage is our fan fictioner, you guys. He, I I'm he got a hundred percent. No, I didn't. Well, you got enough to not get punished. I got in the last quarter, which is eighty to hundred percent. That's crazy. I... How do you feel? Really, talk to the people. <sighs> Take a knee, talk to the people. Who do you want to thank? Uh, first, my mom and Cheyenne. I mean, come on. Clutch as can be. Without them, I wouldn't have made it here. I would have had no sorry, idea. Sorry. I, I would have had no idea what, what those things were. Um, I would have said all boys orgasm. I was a panel on that one. I want to thank... Um, um, I'd like to thank the fan fiction writers. Um, and... and uh, um, I want to thank all the boys for being so hot. The boys for being so hot. The boys for being so hot. The girls for almost not for having existing. penises. Uh, but mostly probably writing those fanfics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, happy Pride. Happy, happy Pride. Pride, you guys. Holy yeah, shit. yeah. I want a million dollars. Yeah. yeah! <laughs> all right, guys. That's it for Who Wants to Be a Fan Fictioner. The one time game show that will probably never happen again because nobody else in my life really knows what fan fiction is. I am so sad about that. So, thank you so much for joining us. Oh my god. Thank you so much for joining us on Who Wants to Be a Fan Fictioner. And maybe someday we'll see you guys again. Your dreams can come true. Fuck who you want to fuck. All right, guys. So, that was the video. We really hope you enjoyed it. We had a lot of fun putting it together and coming up with the idea. Um, But most importantly, I just want to say thank you so much to all the new subscribers we got and our old subscribers, of course. But um, just seeing our channel very slowly growing is so exciting for us. And seeing people interact with our videos and it's, comments. It's been really nice. The it's comments incredible. have been incredible. Some of the comments that people left last video were great. So we love nice. it. If there's something that you want to see us do or react to, we don't have a lot of limits. We have no boundaries. No boundaries. Guys. We'll do we'll it. Do we'll it. watch it, okay? It, whatever you want, we'll we'll do it. Yes. So, uh Reach out, comment on this video it's or any video. Oh really, God. we read all of our comments. Oh Reach out to us on Instagram, on TikTok. We're all grubby buddies on every platform. Yeah. Um, we would love to hear from you guys. But most importantly, we're just so thankful for all of you to be here and uh, to just keep doing what we're doing. Weird, weird nonsense. Yes. So thank you guys so much for subscribing. Please like, share, subscribe if you're not already I earned all of those things today. He certainly did. He certainly Boom. did. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Oh, oh shit. Someone's calling me. Who is it? Is it Hannah?
Hello? Hello? Hannah? Are you alive? Yeah, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I was I was on a game show and you were my lifeline, but <gasps> but it's okay. It's okay. Everything's okay. I, I We got the question right. So sorry. It's okay. What? Just out of curiosity, do you know in fan fiction, what would you have said Avery?